Number one is Jungley, Jimmy McCarthy. Two, Wahiba Sands, Tony McCoy. Three is Exit to Wave, Norman Williamson. Four, Agawada Gold, Russ Garrity. Five is Desert Mountain, Joe Tizard. Six, Eskley Brook, Carlo Allen. Seven, Hurricane Lamp is a non-runner. Number eight is Lord York, Mick Fitzgerald. Nine is Wave Rock, Richard Johnson. Ten, Executive Design, Seamus Chirac. Eleven, Ayurana, Mr. Tom Scudamore, already with the winner on the board. Take out 12, Fate Hill Care. Number 13 is Damus, David Dennis, claiming the three. And 14, Icky Bo, Adrian Maguire. So we've got two. Uh, money this morning, but not uh, here on the track so far for Wahiba Sands and Wave Rock. Very open indeed. It's 9 to 2 to field, with the second favourite being Jungle at sixes. Wahiba Sands, seven, Wave Rock at eight to one. Those were the two there was money for in the offices this morning. Desert Mountain is tens, with uh, Irona also a 10 chance, and Exit to Wave uh, 10 to 1. Uh, Eskley Brook, though, is the 9 to 2 favourite. Sat there racing. Pretty good start too on the outside. Eskley Brook, one of the first away, as they travel now towards the first. And uh, as a faller at the back of the field, executive de decision is gone. Executive decision is a faller at the first, and uh, very quickly up on his feet there. Seamus Duraki appears to be okay, but Icky Bo is the early leader from Eskley Brook. Then Jungley in the green uh, colours on the near side, followed by Agawada Gold and Wahiba Sands. They're followed next by Lord York as they go over the second and a faller there. There's a couple down and uh, Eskley Brook is a faller. Jungley has been brought down on the near side and both riders appear to be OK. As they head now over the third, and Nicky Bow is the leader, but being tackled and passed by Agawada Gold. Wahiba Sands just in behind them, followed by Exit to Wave. Further back then, poking up on the inside is uh, Damus, as they head along now towards the fourth. Further back then, behind them is Ayarana, as they take that one OK. Desert Mountain is back in the field. Last of that main group, and uh, last is Wave Rock, some way detached from the field, about six lengths behind the second last horse, as they travel out with just under a circuit to go. And uh, both Carl Llewellyn and also Jimmy McCarthy up on their feet and walking away, rather dejected after that uh, incident at the second fence. Travelling out with just under a circuit remaining in this Martel Red Rum handicap. Both horses uh, appear to be OK as well. Heading into the back now, and Icky Bo is the leader by half a length, Agawada Girl, three lengths away, Wahiba Sands. A couple further back then is Lord York in the Ogden Colours on the outside of Damus. Further back in the field is Exit to Wave as they take the first one down the back. Agawada Girl was a bad mistake there. Just got away with it too. Well back in centre field is Desert Mountain, starting to make some progress now. Uh, followed next in the field by Ayarana as they come towards the next one. Icky Bo this time is the one who puts in a bad one and is passed by Agawada Gold. Agawada Gold, the green cap, Icky Bo, the, red, the uh, blue cap on the near side as they head towards the next one. Agawada Gold was slow in the air. Wahiba Sands uh, is in third, followed by Desert Mountain. Joe Tizard is coming into it stylishly as they head towards the last one down the back. Icky Bo, the near side, Agawada Gold, the far side and a mistake by Davis back in the field. Icky Bo wasn't fluent at all at that, and Agawada Gold, ridden along, has now taken it up as they leave the back. They've got four left to jump in this Martel Red Rum handicap chase, and it's Agawada Gold by two lengths to Icky Bo as they're on the turn now, uh, heading towards the cross fence, which will be four out. Three lengths further back then is Wahiba Sands, who's battling on well. Desert Mountain in fourth as they head over four out. Bad mistake by Wahiba Sands. That'll knock the stuffing out of him. Ayarana back in fifth position, followed then by Exit to Wave, and well back is Lord York as they're on the turn for home with three fences left to jump. Agawada Gold straightens up in front by two lengths to Wiki Bow. Four lengths away then is Desert Mountain, who's battling on, followed then by Wahiba Sands and Ayarana. Three out now. Agawada Gold jumps it high, but jumps it well. From Icky Bow in second. A long gap then, Wahiba Sands, followed by Desert Mountain. A good gap of 10 lengths to Wairana as they head towards the last ditch. This is two out, and Agawada Gold jumps it in a great style. Lands over at three lengths to Wiki Bow, who 
who's switched out now, trying to raise another effort. A good gap then by Heba Sands, followed by Desert Mountain. They've got one left to jump now, and Agawada Gold by four lengths. Ikibo trying to raise an effort on the near side for Adrian Maguire. They're followed by Wahiba Sands. Agawada Gold getting weary now as they come towards the last, draws towards it, jumps it okay. Wahiba Sands is running on well now for McCoy over on the far side. It's Agawada Gold in front. Wahiba Sands is now starting to fly late. Agawada Gold going up and down in the one stop spot. Wahiba Sands flying photo. Agawada Gold may have just held on from Wahiba Sands, but it's a photo. Then in third is Icky Bo, followed further back then by Exit to Way from Desert Mountain. They're followed by Lord York, then Damon. Number four, Agawada Gold at 12 to 1. Second, number two, Wahiba Sands, 15 to 2. And third, 14, Ikibo at 14 to